Time to turn to Michelle back at the Weather Center for the updates you need. Michelle, Typhoon Solik is likely to make landfall on the peninsula and uh, head northward, and I believe we need to brace for the impact. Well, yes, Daniel, it's the first time a typhoon makes landfall on the peninsula since 2012. Now, on Wednesday, Seoul Lake is expected to reach the southern coast of Jeju Island and make its way up along the west coast of the country. And by Thursday, the entire country will be under heavy rain and wind, and the typhoon will weaken as it exits through Kaunda province over on Friday. Until then, Hot and humid conditions are expected to dominate the forecast this week. And also, it'll mostly be cloudy tomorrow across the Northeast Asia. On to the readings. Hurl starts the day at 25 degrees Celsius tomorrow, while Taegu and Gyeongju wakes up bearable temperatures at 22 and 21 degrees, respectively. The daily highs over in Seoul will top to 33 degrees, while Gwangju hits 35 and Busan at 32 degrees. Now make sure to check the latest forecast regarding the upcoming storm before heading out and take the necessary precautions. I'll leave you with the weather conditions around the world.